A reading from the book of Prophet Isaiah. At first, the Lord humbled the land of Zebulun and the land of Naphtali, but in the latter, He will make glorious the way of the sea, the land beyond Jordan, Galilee of the Gentiles. The people who walked in darkness have seen a great light. Those who lived in the land of the shadow of death, light has shined. You have enlarged the nation; you have increased its joy. They rejoice before you as with joy at the harvest, as people exult when dividing spoils. For the yoke that burdened them, and the rod across their shoulder, and the scepter of their oppressor, you have overcome, as in the day of Midian. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. A reading from the first letter of Saint Paul to the Corinthians. Brothers and sisters, I urge you in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ that all of you be in agreement, and there be no divisions among you, but that you be united in the same mind and in the same purpose. For it has been reported to me about you, my brothers and sisters, by clueless people. That there are rivalries among you. What I mean is that each of you says, "I belong to Paul, or I belong to Apollos, or I belong to Cephas, or I belong to Christ." Has Christ been divided? Was Paul crucified for you, or were you baptized in the name of Paul? For Christ did not send me to baptize, but to proclaim the gospel, and not with eloquent wisdom, so that the cross of Christ might not be emptied. Of its power. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. When Jesus heard that John had been arrested, he withdrew to Galilee. He left Nazareth and went to live in Capernaum by the sea. In the region of Zebulun and Naphtali, this was to fulfill what was spoken by the prophet Isaiah: "Land of Zebulun and land of Naphtali, the way of the sea beyond the Jordan, Galilee of the Gentiles." The people who sit in darkness have seen a great light, and to them dwelling in a land overshadowed by death, light has arisen. From that time onwards, Jesus began to preach and say. Repent, for the kingdom of heaven is close at hand. As he was walking by the sea of Galilee, he saw two brothers, Simon, who is called Peter, and his brother Andrew, casting a net into the lake, for they were fishermen. He said to them, "Come after me, and I will make you fishers of men." At once they left their nets and followed him. Going on from there, he saw two other brothers. James, son of Zebedee, and his brother John, they were in a boat with their father Zebedee, mending their nets. He called them, and immediately they left their boat and their father and followed him. And Jesus went around all of Galilee, teaching in their synagogues, proclaiming the gospel of the kingdom, and healing every disease and illness among the people. The gospel. Of the Lord, praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. <music>